Hey guys, welcome back. Um, today I'm going to be taking you through a Lily Pulitzer um, try on haul. Um, so I've been picking up a few things um, over the past few weeks and I just want to show you some of the goodies that I got, some of the new things that are in store um, and that way you can kind of keep your eyes out for a few things too. Um, but without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into some clothing. Okay guys, so the first piece I'm going to show you um, is going to be this dress right here. So this is the Lorena swing dress um, in the print Always Worth It. And I will say I did size down in this one. I typically go for a size medium. Um, and in this one I decided to grab a size small. And I almost feel like maybe I could have gone for an extra small because there is a lot of room around here. Um, but that's okay because it makes it a really comfy dress just to kind of throw on um, just for like whenever you want it to feel a little bit dressy um, but you don't want to be uncomfortable. So I think this dress is super cute and I'll kind of step up a little closer here so you can kind of see some of the detail. So it just has like a v-neck. It has like a nice wide strap so you don't have to worry about like hiding bra straps or anything like that. Um, and it's got like these cute little like ruffly pieces um, in tiers on the skirt. So that's kind of fun. It adds like a fun little detail to it that's kind of unexpected. Um, I did want to go ahead and throw out there too that um, my lighting might be a little off today. They just put in like a little privacy screen on our windows. Um, and so it may be looking a little dark in here. Um, but I feel like this dress, even on um, the screen without having any extra lighting, it still is pretty true to color. So this next outfit. Um, I've got on the Colette skirt um, in a size 8 um, and I feel like that's pretty true for me. I typically wear a size 8. I took a size 8 in this one so if you're looking for this one it runs pretty true to size. Um, I didn't tuck in my shirt all the way but I just want to show you guys what it kind of looks like without the cardigan hiding it. Um, I think it's really cute. It does have pockets in the front and I think you can undo the pockets in the back. There's like a little string on it. Um, you know to kind of keep that together um, But if you want to use those you can definitely undo that little string um, But yeah, anyways, I think this one's really cute. This is the print um, I believe it's called new blooms on the block um, And it's just like this really bright pink color um, And then this shirt is not from Lily. Um, it's just from Target, but this cardigan on the other hand is from Lily so this is the Noble Fringe Cardigan, and you can see it's got like this nice little fringing at the bottom, and I'll actually kind of show you a little closer up what I'm talking about. But it has like this really cute detail up until about here, and I think that's really awesome. Um, and I think I bought this um, in a medium, and I think it fits pretty well. I think if you wanted to, you could probably size down in it, um, and it would be just fine as well. Um, but And it does come in two colors. Um, it comes in the pink aisle, and then there's another green color. It didn't really, um, I don't really like green that much, but if you are a green person and you really love that green color, you can definitely grab this in that one too. So the next piece that I have, um, I don't have an outfit for this one. I just kind of kept on that same white Target t-shirt, and I just kind of tucked it in, um, just so you guys can kind of see the shape. Um, but these are the Corso pants, um, and I think it's in cockatoo pink. I think that's the one. Um... I didn't really have a whole outfit to put together for this one. I'm trying to like see if I can maybe dress it up a little bit more. But anyways, this is kind of what it looks like on. I think they may be a little bit long for me, but I might try my hand at um, trying to get those altered myself. I don't really know yet, um, but I did grab these in a true um, size 8 as well, and I feel like they fit pretty good. Um, I think these would be really great. Um... Like if you're going for like afternoon walks or something like that. This is technically in their Luxletic line. So it does have more of that athletic material feel. Um, but you can kind of see too. They kind of have more of like a dress pant look. So if you're trying to be a little bit nicer looking without um, looking too athleisurely. Um, when you're going on those afternoon walks or something like that. Um, I think this would be a great option. Especially if you're obsessed with pink pants like I am. All right. So the next thing I have to show you guys um, is this dress, um, and this is going to be the Jackie Shift dress um, in the print Splendor in the Sand. So let me step a little closer here, and you can see a little bit more of the details, but it's got like this pearl 
detail along like the shoulder here and along the neckline. Let me move my hair out of the way so we can just see what that looks like. And it's got like this really fun like blue, coral, and pink pattern all over it. And I think it's so cute. Um, I did grab this one in a size medium, um, but I'll kind of show you. I think there's still quite a bit of room um, right here in the armpit. And I think if you wanted to size down, you probably could. Um, but I just wanted to make sure that um, it was like nice and loose and it wasn't too fitting. But I still think it looks really cute even staying at a size medium and not sizing down um, to kind of close in that gap here. All right, so for this one, I have a whole outfit to show you guys. Um, so we'll start here at the bottom. So this is a skirt, and this is the Mariana um, Luxletic skirt, and I grabbed this one in a size medium. Um, and I do feel like this fits pretty true to size. Um, I normally like for things to kind of hit me like right at the small of my waist, um, but this one tends to sit just a little bit lower. So. Um, more like at the top of your hips. Um, so just a little bit of tip on that one. It does have pockets, so that's super nice. Um, you can kind of see it from the side. Um, but yeah, I think this is a really nice color. It's in Splendor in the Sand. Um, and then this polo top kind of matches it perfectly. And this is the Frida Sleeveless um, Ruffle Polo. And I'll step closer so you guys can see all the little details. So you can kind of see there's like a ruffle detail here. It is a polo, it has some buttons down the front here, um, and I don't really know what the name or the color of this one, um, but it is more of like a corally color, so it's kind of like that pinky orange um, tone, but it matches the coral in this skirt perfectly. So if you're looking for a cute little um, Luxletic outfit, definitely pick up these two items. They go perfectly together. Alright, so this next outfit features something from their newest collection, um, and I believe this is called the Annika um, Squirt, and it's another Luxletic item. You can see it still has the tags on it, I haven't even had a chance to take them off, um, but this is in the print, I think it's called How You Like Me Prowl, like, kind of like, you know, prowling little kitty, because it does have little tigers on it. You can see one there, another one here. Um, but either way, this is super cute. I love this skirt. It has like this nice little tiny ruffle at the bottom and I feel like that just adds something so different to like a tennis skirt. Um, it does have pockets so you can stash some things in there and it does have like the shorts underneath so you can feel nice and covered. Um, I did pair this with one of their um, polos and this one's in the shade pink shandy um this has like another little ruffle right here it is a v-neck um and this one's actually really comfortable but i did size down in this one so typically like i said i take a medium and this is a small and i just kind of felt like um in the medium this was too <laughs> plunging for me i did not care for that so i grabbed a small and i feel like it fits pretty comfortably everywhere. You can kind of see the front and the back. And I don't feel like it's too hugging um, in the sense where it looks like it would be too small on me. Um, but I feel like it just kind of sits nicely on the body like something like an active wear would do. Alright guys, so these next two pieces, I have them paired together, but by no means do I think they make a good outfit. So I just want to throw a little disclaimer out there. I feel like the pinks aren't necessarily right for each other so um, I would say if you are interested in these two pieces and you were thinking that they might go together um, I guess you could really try to make it but I just don't feel like it does it's just not really my vibe um, but anyways we'll start talking about the pieces now um, so this top is just a popover in the print social sunset and I'll kind of step closer so you can kind of see some of the details in it. It's got this fun little zipper, um, which I think is super cute. And I really love the flowers on it. I think they're great for spring. I just picked this up um, just so when we go on walks in the afternoon, once it's starting to cool down, um, I think it'd be a great option just to kind of throw on and go. Um, these shorts are the Weekender High Rise shorts um, in, I think it's called Pink Isle. And I did grab a medium in these. Um, and I feel like that's fine. It does kind of dig in a little bit in your legs. I do have um, 
kind of thicker thighs so if you kind of have that same issue they might dig in just a little bit it's not like an uncomfortable dig or anything but you can definitely see that there is um, some pressure right there on your leg um, so unfortunately if that's something you're trying to avoid uh, it will happen with these um, and I think oh my goodness covered up the whole camera just then um, but there is a pocket right here um, on the right side so you do get a pocket um, and then this top also has like a hoodie pocket too so you can kind of see it goes all the way through um, and I think something I forgot to mention about this top I did pick this up in a small um, it does run a bit oversized like you can even see there's still quite a bit of room up top um, but yeah I think these pieces are super cute Okay, so the next piece I want to tell you about is this top. I did try on this skirt earlier with a different top, but I think these two make a pretty good pairing too. Um, but this is going to be that Gruyere top. Um, it's in their Luxletic range, and I did grab this one in a size medium, um, and it's in the color Pink Shandy. There is a white one on there too, so if you don't want pink, um, there is a more classic option for you. Um, I think this fits really nicely. I do let it kind of sit right at my waist. Um, but I feel like you could let it extend down, like, if you really wanted to. I just feel like it fits, um, or, yeah, it hits really nicely at my waist, um, rather than, you know, trying to pull this down. But, either way, it does have this nice little twist front, um, just to add a little bit of detail, um, to the top. And it does have, like, a seam going down the front here, which I think is really cute. Um... Other than that, I don't really have a whole lot to say about it. I just kind of bought it for um, actually working out. Um, and I'm not really looking for anything too specific. I just wanted a fun pink color um, for my workouts. All right, so the last thing that I have to talk about is potentially a little bit boring, um, but it is going to be this cardigan here. This is the Amelie, or Amelie. I don't really know how to pronounce it. Um, but I'll have everything linked down below, so if you guys are interested in any of the items that I've talked about, I will go ahead um, and leave those down below so you guys can shop those. Um, but anyways, this cardigan I picked up um, just to kind of have something lightweight to wear in the spring. You can see I do have a white t-shirt on underneath, and you can definitely see where that t-shirt sleeve ends um, and where um, you can start to see through um, the cardigan again. You can even see like through the rest of the body too. Like you can very clearly see straight through. This is the skirt. <laughs> this is the top. And there's the skin of my arm. <laughs> um, but anyways, I did pick this one up in a small. Um, just because I felt like in a medium, it was just a little too relaxed for me. But either way, I still think it's really cute. Especially if you're looking for something lightweight for spring. Um, just to kind of keep you a little bit warm on the chilly mornings or the chilly afternoons. Um, and then something you can just take off like after it starts to reach midday and the temperatures are starting to go up. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys kind of enjoyed this video. Um, let me know if you want to see more like it because I can definitely start to pick up more Lily pieces so we can kind of see how those are fitting. Um, if you guys have any questions about anything that I've talked about today, you can definitely leave those down below and I'll try to get back to you just as soon as I can. Um, but other than that, if you guys could just like and subscribe, I do have a video coming up about Love Shack Fancy and some things that I've actually purchased and not just a little wish list video. Um, but yeah, stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys next time.